Okay, what's up guys, Arachnid2 here, and today, uh, it's not gonna re be really much of an entertainment video, or a how-to video of, like, some game, but more of a helpful video to other people. So, let's get started. So, this is how to, this video shows how to take care of your fiddler crabs in a good way. You see, a healthy fiddler crab will wave its claw and keep its eyes up. Only It will only wave its claw though if it's comfortable with its environment. And, and yeah. And they also eat algae. Or the best way to feed them is getting them algae wafers, dropping them in the t into the tank because then they'll dissolve and, they'll, and the crabs will eat the particles with their tiny mouths. These crabs will also, uh, okay, um, they live about, um, three or something years when they're healthy, but they only live about a few months if they're not in a good environment. Like, if you put them in just water, with no, no salt water, that's kind of bad. They can live in fresh water, though, so keep that in mind, but they're healthier in salt water and they also need some land to get on so that they you know they need some land because they like to crawl up on land some crabs are just like that but yeah these are one of the types of crabs some of them are fully aquatic like my painter crab which I can show you not only that but it can't survive in in salt water it can only survive in fresh water let me see if I can put it on camera Ugh. I don't see it. Okay, I don't see it, but this is the tank it lives in. As you see, it's fully aquatic. And it's fresh water, as you can see from some of the fish. Like those rainbow colored ones, and the Australian rainbow, and the yo-yo loaches, and the sharks. Yeah. And these crabs, though, they like salt water more. <laughs> Just keep that in mind. They also like a little bit of land. And they'll, and once you first get them, they'll like to hide if they're really little. If they're bigger, they won't hide, but, but yeah. Um, I, and not only that, but the, the ones with the bigger claws, like, the bigger the claw, the more attractive to a female it is, and it also depends on how they wave it. And, and the females basically, I don't have a female, but the females basically look like the males, except they have two little claws instead of one big one and one little one. That's how you tell the difference. It's a pretty simple spot, but some people don't actually know that, that there's a difference. So yeah, thanks for watching. I hope this video helped you. If it did, and you enjoyed it, then please leave a like. And you can subscribe if you want to. That's not my choice. So, good day.